Hello, welcome. Welcome back if you're a current subscriber. Welcome if you're new. So I have a Scentsy haul from one of the sales. Was it like the Freaky Friday one? It wasn't the new ones they released last Friday. This was when they had bars and stuff actually. So I want to show you my nails because I think in my other video I didn't. I did kind of a funky one on my nails. I Thumbs I did marble, but then here I did some sweater weather and plaid just was feeling a little crazy okay let's start out with the Scentsy Club exclusive so you don't have to order these when you do a Scentsy Club you can be, when you're signed into your like if you're under my website you have a Scentsy Club you're signed in if you go to Scentsy Club exclusives underneath like your account there's like three new pods there's some laundry stuff there's a brick from Scentsy Family Reunion well, the one pod that spoke to me was Zombie Punch. And this is a fruity, yummy, like almost fruit punch smell. This is very good, very strong pod. Um, I honestly think I would do this more in the summer. It, it really smells more like a punch to me, but I'm super excited to grab that. Okay, so I got three in Snow White Kind Heart. I love this scent so much. It's in my club. I, I don't generally like floral. I know some people say they get a different note. Oops, it's broken, which is fine. I know some people say they get an off note in this. I don't, so thankfully it's not ruined for me. I love, love, love this. I didn't get more only because I already have a bar. It's in my club. And you guys, I have so much wax. Like if I ordered 10 of these, it would take me like 20 years to get through. So I felt like four bars in my collection was like good because I'm only gonna do that in the spring, summer anyway, probably more summer. So to me, that was great. Now, the, the next two bars I've had before, it is Mr. Stuff Evil, which I don't know why they didn't bring this back. This is a new pour because it has all the different, um, as you see the flat bottoms, those are older bars. This is a new pour. So obviously people have this in their club. I don't know why they didn't bring this back. I really should have gotten more than this because this is a nice plummy kind of scent. Well, I should have grabbed more. And then Fearless by Nature. I like this one. This is this Sage Outdoorsy? I love this. I think this is my club though too. Oh, so good. These were, I think each of the bars was $3.90. And it seemed like, weren't they mostly Disney? Yeah, I think they were all Disney bars if I remember right, which, they had that other sale on Friday and I, I had worked on Thursday night. I got called into work because we are doing, we had to sign up for 56 hours of mandatory call. So Thursday I got called in, which really made me crabby because I had already worked my hours for the week and then having to pick up I, 16 hours extra this week alone. So Thursday I got called in. Last night I was on call. I just don't like being on call. I slept on the couch till like 2 a.m. and then I finally went to bed um, just because you just never know. And this week I have another six, like every week this month I have like 16 extra hours of call. Not real pleased about it, but anyway, I'm sorry. So on Friday I was sleeping and I, I knew that they launched at noon. So I set my alarm and I went on there quick and went right back to bed because I, first of all, didn't feel good because... Night shift is not agreeing with me. Um, I worked Tuesday night. I got floated to PACU, which is recovery. And I was talking to the nurse who works nights full time. She does Monday, Tuesday, Wednesdays. And she said she does not get sick. Like when I wake up, even at 3 p.m., if I sleep six hours because my kids get home at 3, I feel like I have a hangover. I do not feel good at all for the rest of the evening. Um, I don't know. Nights just is not favorable to me personally it never has been so I'm really struggling so anyway I digress and you probably don't care okay Marvel 9 realms I've never had this before so I thought I would grab one this is okay I don't know what the scent notes are because you know they're not listed here because there's not enough room for them to list them note my sarcasm so I don't know what that is uh Disney just keeps swimming I love this movie. You know what scent? This is nice aquatic. You know what scent I was hoping for? Was it from Aladdin, the blueberry one? My friend had a really, really old bar of that and I was able to smell it. And I didn't buy it from her because it was really, really old. But I would love that blueberry scent from Aladdin. 
this is good. I'm happy to have a bar of this and try this. Um, this one is Milan True to Your Hearts. Again, these were all new to me. This is a pretty floral. Oh, I wish I would have grabbed more of this one. Is this like a floral? Mmm, I like that one. I might have to search that out after I warm it. We'll see how it warms. And then Mickey, um, or Mickey Mouse, your pal Mickey. Again, these are all new pour bars. So, you know, Sensi can pour whatever they want. So they could put more in these sales. My rambling was about Friday, waking up, setting a stinking alarm just to see what kind of wax they had. And then there was no wax. And then they also sold out of the mystery pack warmers. It's like, come on. I didn't even get the mystery bars. I thought, what if I got all fairy, fairy, fairy tale pumpkin? I don't love that scent. So for me, that would be like, oh, no, I can't do it. Okay, I got a spider. I do not like spiders, but my niece probably will think this is super cute. It is in caramel apple craze, which I love, but I just grabbed it. It was like $2, so I'll give it to my niece, my sister's daughter. And then I, since I was going in, I had this already in my cart loaded, and I'm glad I grabbed this because this is sold out now. This is Snow Kiss Cranberry. If you guys saw one of my last hauls, my friend does have this in her club, and I was able to get three bars of it. This is the best cranberry scent I've ever smelled. I really wish Scentsy again. Why do they get rid of such great scents? So I'm happy to have this. I just want to tell you a little trick that I've noticed. So if I use Counter Clean on my uh, counter straight up, it leaves a lot of streaks. So what I've been doing is, I, right now I have two bottles downstairs, and for this one I'll have to put it in my glass bottle, but I have two of the same downstairs, so I poured, I had an empty one, so I poured half and half of this and then added half water to it, and I haven't had any streaks. Now, I don't think this is disinfectant. This is just a cleaner. I don't believe this has any disinfecting property. Like, it doesn't claim that it's going to kill uh, germs. I don't see that on here, but I could be wrong. I think it's just a cleaner. So I added water because why not? It's not a disinfectant. It's just cleaning it. So that has helped. So I don't get streaks and it lasts a lot longer. I have a lot of kids and every time they make a mess, they spray like half of the bottle on the mess. So that also has helped. So that's a trick. I'm going to keep doing it. I don't care because I do not like the streaks I get if I don't dilute it. So that's just me. Okay, this is see the good. So see the good in all things. So this one, I'm gonna open it. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. I love this. I've wanted this forever. I should have bought two because, oh my gosh. I am such a holographic girl and this is hollow. Like, oh my, <laughs> I love this. And it has one of the original Scentsy bottoms. If you look at the new warmers, they have this new bottom that they can, they did it so that they could, if a warmer dies, instead of sending the whole warmer, they can just send the bottom piece. Um, so this was such a good price. And like I said, I've been watching this for months and months and months and months. I believe it sold out. So this was such a great deal. I got, Another one of Tiger's Eye Pumpkin. So I'll insert a photo because I already have this up in my fireplace. They're actually gonna get put away probably today sometime maybe or this week because my Christmas stuff is gonna go up and all this is gonna be taken away. Um, so I did get another one of these because I absolutely love this. This is the dark one. Can I just tell you a trick on this? If you put the clear bulb in it, you're gonna see the bulb, but I put in a a orange bulb and I can't see the bulb in this. So I have loved these warmers. I have, I, maybe I'll insert a photo of my mantle right now. I have three or four pumpkins up there that are like this. I love these. I think these are one of the best fall warmers that Sensi makes. So if you love this, I hope you snagged it or grabbed another one. I know I was watching Patrice. She's from Canada. She has a YouTube channel and she was saying how hers got broke and then she found another one and then Patricia had picked it up and got it to her, whatever. But I was, I think I commented on her video. Like, did you see they're up in the sale? I don't know if she got one, but I just thought of her as soon as I saw that because I thought of that. Like, what if that warmer got broken? That's like one of my favorites. So when this was in the sale, I was like, I, I don't want to be that person who's like, oh, I'm going to back up my warmers, but I have two Christmas warmer. Well, you're going to see the next warmer. This will be my third warmer. 
and I'm going to put all three out and you'll see why in a moment. But long story long, like sometimes it's okay to have two of a warmer because you like I could put it, you know, in several rooms or I could have one on this space. You know what I'm saying? Like it's okay. And for the price, I was fine with it. Okay. So this is the one that is my third one. You guys, this is the most beautiful warmer. It has three pieces. I will open and show you this because this is going to go out. To, um, I don't know if it'll go here. I'm not sure if this one's going to go up here because... I kind of bought it in the thought of like, I was, so I put my mate, this is going to be a long video of me chatty, um, but it's my video, so it's fine. I put up the big Christmas tree I'm just waiting for. I ordered another. I have LED lights on it because it was a lit Christmas tree. I would never buy a lit Christmas tree again because I think the lights lasted me eight years and now they, I have tried, you guys, I've, I've tried like testing them. I bought like extra tools to test and they kept popping and blowing and they were black. And I was like, oh, I don't feel comfortable with this anymore. So I don't use them anymore. So last year I ordered two LED lights. You can set them on different modes and they're like the softer light. Well, I this year I really wanted to make sure that every branch had a lot of them. So when I got to the top, I was like, oh, I have like a quarter of well, a third of the tree left. So let, uh, I think it was on Friday. Yes. Yeah. Two days ago, I went on Amazon and ordered just another set. So I think those came while I was recording another video. And so I'm going to finish putting those up. But I also next to my tree is like the shelf and I was putting up warmers and my daughter and I went to Hobby Lobby last night. I'll insert a photo of what we bought there. She was hysterical, by the way. She's always fun to shop with. Um, <laughs> She's, she's a character like her mother. <laughs> and you know what? That's a good thing. That's a good thing. All right. So this comes in several pieces. Okay. Do not throw this away. So here's the dish. This has the ring around it for your warmer. Okay. So you need that because that's what this dish will set onto on top of the ring. And then there's a bottom that is the base. I'm going to show you this because... I don't know if you all snagged this, but you should have. This is the most stunning warmer. I my I saw this on like Instagram one time when I was searching um, when I was searching for Christmas, and it's only a 20 watt. I don't care. This is way too beautiful not to get. Okay, here's this thing. This is so pretty. Okay. So here's your base. Your light would go in here. This sits on that, okay? It's very simple. So I found it on eBay. I know I shouldn't have, but I asked my friend when I first started getting into Scentsy and I didn't know anything. So I was like, can you find this warmer for me? She's like, yeah, it doesn't work like that. I thought, why would Scentsy discontinue this warmer? It's absolutely stunning. So this goes, wait, this way, sorry. So the little bulbs, the little balls you can see go up, okay? So I found it on eBay. Then my second one was actually somebody local that was selling it. What are the chances of that? Okay. Uh, hello, how beautiful is this? I'm not going to plug this in. I'll take a, I don't want to drop this because it's a little um, touchy. And I, if I drop this, I, I think I would shed a tear. So I will insert a little video of this. This is absolutely stunning. I don't know if it's still listed. I don't know anything. What I will say is this is like my favorite, one of my favorite Christmas warmers. The holiday lights that they brought back last year that were part of the Christmas like favorites collection. I bought two of those and the mini. That thing is reminds me of my grandparents' Christmas tree and my grandpa was like my dad. And so I had to have that warmer. And then I found another one on Macari because it sold out before I closed a party. So I was able to get a second one. But the lady had broke the dish. So then Sensi, like six months later, because Patricia Gates told me, wait for about six months and they'll bring out the dish. Thank you for that, because they did. So now I have two of those warmers plus the mini and that I just love my Christmas warmers. <laughs> Okay, and then this is also very similar. I think this one is still listed, but I'm not 100%. This is the Gold Crush. My dog's from. She um, is an amazing breeder. 
she has this and I've seen it so many like every time I go to her house I'm like oh my gosh I wish I could get that warmer I wish they still made it um they don't but they had it here so what watt is this one this one feels like a 25 it does it is a 25 oh this is very heavy so it's like that mosaic again great performer you know with these um the crackle so this has a base again okay so again i have loved this and i'm like oh my gosh i mm -hmm. i don't know that this will go out though i don't know if this one's gonna go out because this is more like fall ish to me i guess and i don't think it has a particular it doesn't say which way it goes so i would assume it's either one okay again same thing this one says do not throw a ring warmer ring inside so don't throw away this piece because this sits in here so this one is called gold crush and the dish is like this and then the dish sits inside of here so there's your dish and again this is a 25 so i imagine this one will be a beautiful performer you guys I wish Sensi would do these again. I absolutely love these. I am such a fan. I am so excited to have this. If I had never seen this from my friend, I would have never ordered this because I would have thought, well, who cares? But this is so pretty. Every time I go to her house, she has this on in her living room. Such a great performer, she tells me. And she's got a really big open concept like I do. She doesn't do a lot of Sensi. She loves Amazon Rain. Like that's her favorite. If they ever took that out, I would have to club that for her because she always needs that. <laughs> um, but this is such, like I said, a beautiful warmer. Again, in person, like all of these in person are so much prettier than you could even imagine um and you know I can complain or say things about Scentsy but I certainly will say that their warmers are second to none I just thoroughly enjoy them I don't agree with a lot of things and I obviously make that very well clear but I'm always going to give my honest opinion about anyone um or any company and uh certainly will raise my voice if it needs to be right uh, but they do warmers well. I, I, I don't always agree with their pricing. Like I really want that sand, uh, snowman warmer for Christmas, but I can't justify the price for that one warmer. Like if it was under a hundred, I would have probably bought it because I absolutely love Christmas and that snowman is just breathtaking. Um, but I just can't justify it. And I went to Hobby Lobby with my daughter and they had like smaller trees that were similar and you push the button and they have the holographic glitter and that goes around and it they have clear christmas trees or the one i got was like green with the star golden star and wait till i show you in a video i'll do a warmer update i i do have my warmer tours if you look oh my kids yelling um but i do have my winter wonderland warmer tour from last year so you can kind of see but that I just my daughter and I went to Hobby Lobby and I was pretty good I spent way less than I thought because everything was on sale which was great but I did get some other trees because I'm like I just can't justify that warmer like I said I have to stick to a certain limit and justify like that's a little bit too much for me to spend but these warmers were a great deal and like I said obviously already having that these two warmers well, the three or four I got were all for certain reasons. Like I said, I try to, if they have good deals on the warmers, I will get them as gifts. Um, or I have friends who will message me or call me and say, do you have a warmer? I have like a, a party to go to. And then I do like having, uh, I'm working on getting a few more just to keep at the house because I've had so many requests for that. So, and, and I like giving them to the teachers for gifts for Christmas as well. So usually the mini warmers, cause if I get those on sale, sometimes you can get them for 10 bucks. And so that's a great deal. Anyway, I'm rambling. Thank you guys so much for watching, commenting, subscribing. I truly appreciate you all so very much. And with that being said, I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day. Bye.